so gloomy I'm, I'm not able to film anything any reels not able to shoot anything because it's been so gloomy and it looks like it's 7 p.m. already but anyway I will fill you in let's just chica time instead then let me just borrow Sienna's chair so I'm not crouching tiger here so it's just been us girls these past few days because Yoni has been in Europe to enjoy his bachelorhood what no just kidding he went to Europe for his new business which is Penny services if you guys are not following on Instagram yet make sure to follow you you will love it if you guys love a minimalist, clean, modern, stylish aesthetic and you're currently constructing or you have a store or you have an office you want to make sure it looks cool and crisp and nice and special then make sure to follow but anyways he's currently in Italy to do some training there and then he's gonna head to Spain for his friend's bachelor's party which is why we're currently here without any man in the household. Today's agenda though is to go to Bello. It's been more than a month now. Like it's been a really, really long time since I last went to the Bello clinic. So it's much, much overdue. So we're gonna do that. And then let's see, let's see how it goes. We're gonna do a days in life once again. Lots of things gonna be happening in between. So yeah, I'm gonna bring you guys with me. Honestly, way overdue already to do this visit. Last month, I was to go to Doc Biggie to do Advalite. It's actually my favorite treatment, one of my favorite treatments here in Belo. You guys all know I've been experiencing like breakout stages, right? And we finally figured out, Doc Vicky and I, what's happening to my skin. And it's really, we feel that my skin barrier got really abused. I think it just got really confused for a while when I had that really bad breakout I told you guys about in Europe. Last year pa. So we feel that's what started it. Before, I said whenever I get breakouts, it's because of what I'm eating. It's like a gut issue or it's like hormonal. But this time, it doesn't feel like it's hormonal because it's not just... On my chin and then all of a sudden i've been noticing also that my skin has become so so sensitive I mean, i've always known that my skin is sensitive but it's just crazy sensitive the previous months so then doc vicky said that you know what let's do a skin reset and i've actually been doing it before she talked to me about it i had the same feeling pala, feeling dermatologist but anyway what i was doing was correct na pala. i started like really using gentle products only the bare minimum to really reset my skin so for a while i've just been using the gentle cleanser of skin zero skin health but then because now we're stripping everything doc vicky said let's go for the exfoliating cleanser now because you need to exfoliate still so let's stick with exfoliating cleanser but let's remove everything else and then that's it but then i told nga doc vicky na doc i'm actually using this new moisturizer that was given to me by manning miranda kerr no, just kidding. But it's by Cora Organics and they sent me this product and I tried using it actually when we were in Finland recently because my skin felt so dry and it just works like I don't get any breakouts from it and then Doc said okay you can keep using that whenever you feel like your skin is dry if it's not breaking you out then good because I told her I feel like it's so calming and it doesn't make my skin feel heavy and I feel like it helps calming my skin down and really restoring my skin barrier. And then you guys know that I've always talked about Centella Asiatica that it's one of the main ingredients of restoring your barrier. With Doc Vicky, she was telling me that with her, she breaks out with it. But with me, I don't. So I tried to spot treat also with Centella Asiatica to help my skin um, rejuvenate. And then like recently, 
I just realized, I'm having a point. I was just supposed to talk to you guys, like why I'm supposed to do analyte. So anyway, um, we're also a bit of confused because am I really oily skin or am I getting oily because my skin felt so abused and like the way that Doc Nikki is saying, Anna. Because I've always known that I've got oily skin, right? But now I always feel like it's dry on the surface, but then after a while it gets oily. Like I feel like it's the thing that I always tell you guys about. Now if you make your skin overly dry, then it overcompensates because it feels like it needs to hydrate and moisturize your skin more. So then you become more oily. So then yeah, I was also confused na nga if my skin is like oily pa or dry and Doc Vicky nga was saying na she feels that my skin is actually still oily but on the surface it's dry because na it's very abused but underneath it's still oily. So she feels that we really have to stop everything. It's been attacked. Like that's how she feels na parang it's been attacked both physically because I also keep poking my skin. It's been attacked physically and also underneath. Like on the superficial level and also underneath in the deeper level. So yeah, so I've gone through like a skin reset and my skin has become so so much better. Not a lot of breakouts anymore. But there are a lot of marks still, right? And so Advalite is one of the things that I really really love using because it's not abrasive. So if your skin is sensitive, then it's fine. It's not gonna make your skin feel like it went through a lot. Like it actually helps your skin heal. So basically Advalite, what it does is it removes like dark spots, redness, pigmentation, like all Automatically, if you do a cleaning and then you do Advalite right after, you're not red. Like your skin just looks very flawless. And then aside from that, it also is antibacterial, so it really helps also with preventing acne. So yeah, and that's why it's one of my favorites. It's not painful at all, like super duper not. And I feel like even if you've got a normal pain tolerance, it's not painful at all. So yeah, now we're gonna go wash my face. So we're now all done and you can see here like I have dark spots here. These are new pimples that I got and also here. So when you do the Advalite, it actually makes your marks darker for like 2-3 days and then after that it disappears or like it really lightens up so 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 much. So usually with Advalite, there's also a chance that you might break out if you don't clean your face. Meaning like if you don't get your existing pimples extracted because the heat will activate that. But it's a, a minor inconvenience. So with Advalite, it makes use of two lasers. So it's called 1319 and 589, I think, if I remember correctly. So these lasers, so one you'll see is a heat laser, like it makes use of heat. And that one really targets your pores, makes your pores smaller, also your oil glands so that you don't get as oily. I remember this because the last time I used Advalite, it really made me feel like my skin was less oily as well. And then aside from that, it also activates your collagen. And then with the 589, that's the yellow laser and that really targets the pigmentation like the brown spots, the red spots. It's also antibacterial so it's the one that really kills the bacteria as well. If you've got rosacea or if you've got melasma then this is also good for you. It treats that as well. So yeah, that is why it's the favorite of a lot of people. It's actually Doc Vicky's personal favorite as well. So I just have to come back after two weeks and make it a more of a regular habit because I haven't been doing that. So I promise to better myself. <laughs> So now I'm gonna go meet Lorreen for a date. She's bringing me out on a date because I have no date tonight. Come along. <laughs> there is my date. We have a fancy date. Fine diner. Healthy Shabu Shabu is the restaurant. It's actually one of her favorites. And coincidentally, since it's our favorite namin siya, Biggie and Yoni hates coming here because they got abused technically. So there's our chance. Because they're not here, oh see? Table for six, for two. There are no men here, only girls. So, ayan, we took advantage. Now. And so we're here. This is how we're ending the night. 
What do you mean? We had big plans. We thought we were gonna have cocktails, but then the rain is so so bad. The as responsible adults, we just felt, you know what? Para kami na bento cocktail, like mula bas. Oh, oh, oh. Para we'll masira yung mood ng very slight. Oh, so we'll just do like a chill night in with some red wine, you know, like as as women in their thirties would. I was, alam mo sa mga lain na sabi ko, sabi ko, but the night is young. It's so <laughs> early. This is it. So this is it. This is, this is how we're ending the night. Cheers. Cheers. Down it. <laughs> we have to be joke sophisticated. Joke sophisticated. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow again. Good night. So we're finally dressed up. Both Sienna and Mama. Where are we going, Sienna? Both. Tell the people. Tell the people where are we going. <laughs> we're going on a double date with Riley and Hazel. Yeah. What do we do when we eat? We chew first. How do you chew? Chew. Mm. Chew. How do you chew? Nam nam nam. And then before you eat the next one, you have to show Mama ah. ah. Ah, show mommy ah. Ah. Oh my god, it's only been a week that Yoni's gone. And already so many things have happened with this girl. So many improvements already. Yes, my love, where do we go? Coco. Coco is already in the bag to be brought by us for a double date. Okay? Oh, what do you want? Just tell mommy, you swear. Yes, let's put them. Okay, and then bear, give mommy bear. Okay, then give mommy bunny. Okay. Okay, can mommy put seatbelt? Yes? Yes. Because they have to be safe, right? Yes. Okay. Choop. Seatbelt. Okay. Now we have to bring them back to the room, my love. Beep beep. Oh no! Oh no! Mommy help? Yes. Okay. Oh no! Okay. Yay! All safe and sound, my love. Hold on, mommy just fixes this. Yes. 
What a cool girl, this girl. One more? Again? Yes. Yes? Okay. And then how do you do beautiful eyes? Okay, and then say ako. Ako. I. I. Ba. Ma. Ba. Ba. It. Uh, it. Yeah. Sienna, Yayi, and I are currently on the way to the mall. I'm just gonna do a quick pull out at Louis Vuitton because I'm doing a collab with them again and they wanted me to shoot one of their new arrivals. So we're just gonna do that real quick and then the rest of the day we'll just follow whatever is Riley and Sienna's heart's desires. So she's currently asking for a snack and Yaya is not giving her! Making Sienna about diet! No, just kidding. She's not. She was just getting impatient because Yaya was getting a snack. Yeah, correct, Sienna Bog. Mm -hmm. Yes? Yes? Can you see? E. A. -E. No, er. A. -E. This is the bag I'm gonna be shooting. It's from Fall Winter. So it's got straps as well. It's got a long strap and also top handle straps. It's pretty cute. So now I just have to choose an outfit to go with it. Okay, let's read it. Okay, okay. In bowl. Oh, you don't see it, right? You have to stand up, my love. You have to stand so you can see it. So mommy flips the page, have to be gentle. Mama! <laughs> sure, this is mama. And then wow! Mama! Mama again? All the models are mama. All the women in this book is mama. <laughs> she finds this cover funny. Okay, next. Mama! Mama again! Mama too! Mama again! Ang taas mo nang bilib ng anak ko sa akin. My gosh! Madam. Look who's here! It's Bibu! Hi! <laughs> At si Yaya na muntik ng masagasaan po ni Bibu. And Riley! Look at them here, so cute. Ay, bye, Riley Bear! <laughs> So many toys, what do you like is mommy's used oil film. I see. You like it, my love? Yes? Yes? Here you go, my love. It's not a bunny, my love. It's a girl. Cannot kiss, okay? No kiss, no kiss. 
have to clean first. My love, it's the same as the one you got. It's this one. Oh, there you go, my love. You like that? Oh, no kiss, no kiss. <laughs> wow. It's time for happy hour for the mommies and happy hour also for the babies, but different kind of a happy hour for them. Cheers. Hey, cheers. Yay. Cheers. But wait, there's more. Hello! Hello, Kong Kling. Hi, po. Welcome back to my channel. So it's currently 7:30 p.m. and I joined Camille because we are gonna drink some really good cocktails. Which means it's time to say goodbye to the vlog. Ay ni ba? Hindi natin alam. Oh, pero siguro yeah, na naman. Yeah, goodbye na natin yung vlog para tapos na, di ba? Ah. Ano na? <laughs> and with that, we're gonna enjoy the weekend, have a good cocktails, have some fun. Maybe might follow, we don't know, but we are gonna say goodbye for now. If you guys enjoy this vlog, you know what to do. Leave some love, like, comment below, and subscribe! What do you call my followers? Kata! Bye, Kata! See you next time! Bye! 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 Bye!